It's the 2014 Tales on Tap competition sponsored by Dram Bowie. Here at Tales of the Cocktail 2014. Please try all of the cocktails. My good friend, national brand ambassador of Dram Bowie, Anthony Caparelli. What's happening, Anthony? How are you, Tom? I'm doing great. And I, I'm, you had me back again as a judge this year. Thank you for inviting me back. Dude, always, always. Love working with you, man. Well, me too. And you and I are about to go taste the three top contestants of... The Tales on Tap. This started uh, three years ago. We, you know, we were looking for a new trend in the cocktail world to kind of, um, you know, take some ownership of. And Drambuie is perfect for draft cocktails. So you and I are judging with Jonathan. He yeah. was the the first year winner. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So John Howard of American Whiskey in New York uh, won the first annual Drambuie. Tails on tap, draft cocktail competition. Um, so what I like to do is bring the winner back as one of the judges, right? Because they obviously know what they're doing. So in addition to my favorite media guy in the whole world. So, you know, you and I, we, I love working with you, man. I love judging. You have such a great palate, such a profound understanding of, of what's in the glass. Um, and then to bring on an operations guy like John. What do you think? I mean, would you like them? I liked them all. They all had some different complexities, some different expressions. What we did is basically equal parts, a uh, half ounce of both the Drambui Hendrix, three quarters ounce of Koki Rosa, a couple dashes of Pichotes because we are in New Orleans, right? Yeah, we gotta go that route. And a grapefruit peel. Easy, effective, gets the job done. What are you making for us here? So today my cocktail is, uh, I call it the Imperial March. So it's a three quarters ounce of Drambui, three quarters of an ounce of uh, Lustau Amatiliado Sherry, a half ounce of Punta Mes Vermouth, and a quarter ounce of Smith & Cross Jamaican rum. And just a little bit of orange oil over top, served up. Nice. Today I'm making a cocktail called the Golden Bear. It's got a little uh, Drambui, of course, Akavi, dry vermouth, uh, gin, and orange bitters. It's very tasty. Thank you. <laughs> So the winner today was Jake Bliven. He had the Rust and Roses. Great name, great cocktail. Yeah, nothing sells like a good name. But you got to back it up with what's in the glass. And man, what do you think? I mean, loved it. A lot of complexity, really approachable. And uh, I could have several of those and be pretty happy. The thing that I really liked about the drinks that we had today is all of the other ingredients kind of went, they, 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 they got under the Drambuie and lifted it up and took particular flavor notes from the Drambuie spice mix. So your cocktail won the top prize. I'm amazed. I mean, honestly, not only uh, were the other two gentlemen's cocktails incredible, but they're such class act guys. Too. Just everybody had different expressions of it, but they're all just, you know, award winning cocktails. All right, from Tales of the Cocktail 2014 with Anthony Caparelli. You know it, man. Here at Tales on Tap. <laughs> Thanks so much for working with us, man. I appreciate it. It's such a pleasure Absolutely. working with you. Always, buddy. Cheers. Cheers, bud.